Welcome back to Game Time with Jake and Sam, where we break down the biggest matches in sports. I'm Jake, your resident hype man. And I'm Sam, here to bring you the facts and figures. Today, we're diving into the Eras Cup showdown between Portugal and France. What a game, Sam. Did you see that goal by Ronaldo? Absolutely, Jake. Ronaldo's header in the 75th minute was a textbook example of positioning and timing. It's no wonder he's one of the best in the world. That goal was insane. But let's not forget about France's early dominance. Mbappé was on fire right from the start. Indeed. Mbappé's speed and ball control were phenomenal. His goal in the 20th minute set the tone for France, showing why they were such a formidable team. The midfield battle was intense too. Portugal's Bruno Fernandes versus France's N'Golo Conte, what a matchup. It was a masterclass in midfield play. Fernandes showcased his creative passing and vision, while Conte was relentless in his defensive duties, breaking up plays and providing stability for France. And that save by Portugal's keeper, Rui Patricio, in the second half, wow. He really kept them in the game. That save was crucial. Griezmann's shot was heading straight for the top corner, and Patricio's reflexes were spot on. It's moments like these that can change the course of a match. Speaking of game changers, how about the tactical adjustments from both coaches? Santos and Deschamps were like chess masters out there. Definitely. Santos made a smart move bringing on Joao Felix, who added an extra layer of creativity to Portugal's attack. Meanwhile, Deschamps' substitution of Coman for Griezmann brought fresh energy to France's offense. And let's not forget the physicality of the game. Both teams really left it all on the pitch. There were some heavy tackles and intense duels. It was a fiercely contested match, no doubt. But credit to the referees for keeping control and ensuring the game flowed smoothly despite the physical challenges. So, Sam, who do you think was the standout player of the match? That's a tough one, Jake. Both teams had several standout performances, but I'd have to go with Ronaldo for his decisive goal and overall influence on the game. I agree, but I'm also giving a nod to Mbappé. He was relentless and kept Portugal's defense on their toes all night. Fair point. It's matches like these that remind us why we love football. The Eras Cup is truly showcasing some top-tier talent this year. Absolutely. And for our listeners, what did you think of the game? Head over to our social media and share your thoughts. We'd love to hear your opinions. That's all for today's episode of Game Time with Jake and Sam. Thanks for tuning in. And remember, folks, whether you're Team Portugal or Team France, it's all about the beautiful game. See you next time.